former U.S. Ambassador John Kabe warns Nigerian government about the continued detention of Namde Kano. Hello, great viewers and subscribers. Welcome to this noble channel where we will tell you the truth the way it is without missing words. According to the news of today, former U.S. Ambassador John Kabe and so many other Americans has won Nigerian government to set mass Namde Kano's free. According to John Kabe, he cautioned the Nigerian authorities against the far-reaching implication of flooding the people judgment with the charge and acquitted the leader of Nigerian people of Biafra I Pop, Mazen Namde Kano. He said Nigerian government cannot afford any more mishandling of Kano's case. The safety and security of the country depends on it. According to the former US envoy and so many others, they said, I quote, the safety and security of Nigeria depends on largely on the outcome of Mazen Namde Kano's case. Now, apart from Kambe, some other United States leaders has also called for Mazen Namde Kano's release. And they have been doing that from time to time. No doubt I dislike her bidding because of his contribution in the kidnap of Mazen Namde Kano. No doubt I dislike him because he allowed Buhari government to terrorize Biafra land because they asked for freedom. No doubt I dislike him because he has refused to do the right thing by asking this criminally minded Nigerian government to create an environment for a referendum for Biafrans to determine their fate. You and I know that this country was created by Lugade, a British grandfather who made it known that after 2020, 2013, Anybody that is suffocating in the so-called fake creation should take a walk if they don't no longer comfortable with the creation of the criminally minded entity called Nigeria. Today, so many people have asked for the freedom of their people. Today, gentleman Lamazin Namde Kano has asked for the freedom of his people. That is the only crime the Nigerian government believes he committed. And for this reason, they have done everything possible to continue to frustrate the gentleman for no reason. And Bidin has continued to supply. Nigerian government with a Tikono aircraft to bombard innocent Hebrews in their land. And for this reason, I dislike him. I see him as someone who I may qualify as a man who has nothing to offer. Or maybe when it comes to Americans, freedom is right. But when it comes to indigenous people of Biafra, freedom is no longer alternable. That is what I dislike so much. And for this reason, I see him as a man who is not qualified to be the United States president. When you are tribalized, when you believe so much in religion, more than the people you're supposed to protect. That alone shows that you are not qualified to lead any position in both Africa, in the world, and the countries at large. Because you end up listening to tribalized people Who happens to be a people, or you end up doing the wrong things because of religion.
So this is why I disliked that man that caused himself bidding. So many things has gone wrong in Biafra land because he gave Buhari power to do so. Why Trump was here? Somehow Trump may have his own problem. Because nobody is perfect. Some may call him racist. But first I'm concerned. He refused to give him Buhari to connect jet because he knows what he's planning to do with it. Because he was afraid. He was afraid he would use it to do wrong things because he sees Buhari as a terrorist that he was. Today we have a drug baron in office as the president of Nigeria because some of Nigerians who believe so much in tribalism use forced killing, maiming, kidnapping, Stolen of balloon buses, 500 billion naira for INEC officials, bribed off Chicago University just to make sure that he become the president of Nigeria. Run fast, pursue it, catch it, and grab it. And this man, since he came into office, has refused to release freedom fighters who the court of law has set free. I am not telling him, or everybody in the world is not telling him to release those who court has not set free. Because as far as I'm concerned, I believe in law and human right is also one of the greatest things that human beings should talk about, that government should respect. But when you are encroaching in people's rights, that means you are nothing but a chicken shit. And this is why I dislike Biden so much. He has contributed immensely in the killing of so many Africans, including Biafrans, who they have killed in numbers. Biafrans never rise up, go to the northern part of the country, or go to European land to behead any children or to kill anybody. Bear France has been genuine. Bear France has been struggling. The only fault that you can claim Bear France have <laughs> is because they are asking for art from Nigeria in referendum boss, not by force. Nani Kalo made it clear and he never said otherwise. But Nigerian government seized that opportunity to bring him in after they kidnap him, cause havoc with the help of some criminally minded politicians in Igbo land. Especially, for example, both the man and David Oman. We we a full of I always call you a full of because that's what you are. I believe you have listened to your music. This is what it is, and this is why we are not to say that we will never stop on the Biafra is restored. Listen, I'm the canon. Believe me, it will be better for everybody. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Cheers.